For the 2019-2020 school year, Texas school districts and open enrollment charter schools are required to increase salaries for full-time employees. However, those raises don't go into effect until September and teachers still need to stock their classrooms. Our Olivia Levada joins us live from her desk in Colleen. And Olivia, teachers have found a way to pay it forward to each other through the Texas Teachers Amazon Gifting Facebook group. That's right. This is the page right here. I spoke with the creator of the group, a former Waco ISD teacher who has since moved to Dallas, and she says she started the group as a way to pay it forward after someone picked up her tab at Starbucks. We had just ordered them, and someone bought it for us. The person in front of us bought our order, and I was like, wow, that's so cool. We could pay it forward. The one act of kindness led to thousands of acts of kindness. Texas Teachers Amazon Gifting is a group that we started for Texas teachers where they could share their Amazon wish list to each other, amongst each other, and start gifting and paying it forward to other teachers. Created a little over a week ago, the page already has almost 4,000 members. And what it's allowing us to do as teachers is to actually fill our classrooms with the necessary supplies in order to start the beginning of the school year. Because during the school year, we aren't given as teachers, we're not given money to supply our classrooms. We, and I'm a high school teacher, I don't get a paper that I get to send home with school supplies. It's all on me and it's all on all of the teachers. Not too long ago, lawmakers passed what some people are calling historic legislation to help the Texas public education system. House Bill 3 requires districts to allocate 30% of their yearly budget toward full-time employees, increasing the minimum salary schedule. Even with the pay increase courtesy of the bill, teachers still need to find ways to fill their classrooms right now. We did just get raises. It just haven't come into effect yet. We haven't seen those yet. We still have to have our classrooms ready for day one. She says the page is a gift that keeps on giving. Paying it forward. It's not about the receiving of the gift. It's about the feeling you get when you give to others because you know that you're not only helping other people, you're helping other students across the state. You're helping people everywhere. And she encourages anyone who wants to participate to hop online and join the group. In Colleen, Olivia Leveda, Central Texas News Now. Olivia, thank you. According to a recent study, 94% of public school teachers say they spent their own money on notebooks, pens, and other supplies in the 2014 and 15 school year without reimbursement. And the average amount spent, $479.